me to put my hair back the way it was, which was big and fluffy. But I love my hair. Um, so let me know what you think about my hair. I have it locked up. Um, and it's simple. And so I was looking forward to something easy to maintain and something that I wouldn't have to tie up or, um, you know, manipulate too frequently. And this is perfect. I think it's cute. I think I'm adorable. I love the way my hair looks. But let me know how you feel about it. I made it through the first week of school. It's Friday. There were a couple of glitches. Um, but, you know, we made it through. I think it's going to be a good year. My lower back is a little sore because um, as I was driving home this week, I was hunched over um, my steering wheel because um, I was driving through a lot of rain and storms. So I was a little stressed out. And I did that for about three or four days. And today, even though it's not raining and I'm driving home a little more comfortably, weather-wise, my lower back is a little sore from driving in such a tense position for so long, for so many days. So I'm gonna go home, it's Friday. Uh-oh, here we are, traffic. See, this is why I love YouTube, because I could always videotape during traffic. Um, so I'm gonna go home, have a salad, um, perhaps have a glass of wine, and soak. I may go to the gym and uh, get into the sauna or the steam room or I just might soak in uh, my tub at home but I'm feeling a lot of tension on my lower back and I love my body and I love to baby my body and take really really good care of it so any little pinch or any little twinge of uncomfortability I like to address it as soon as possible in a natural way. So while I was at work, I did some stretches, tried to do a few yoga poses to pull out some of those muscles a little bit, um, but I still feel stiff. And um, it's only on one side, so that's the thing that's a little frustrating. So I'm going to see if I can address that this weekend. But I'm looking forward to the weekend. The weekend is when we meet, Saturdays and Sundays. I try to give you some encouragement for the week. Um, I try to give you some my ideas and I try to, you know, um, express gratitude for what I've um, accomplished the prior week. And I'm really grateful that I made it to Friday, the first week of school. Um, I was able to get everything organized in time um, for my students and um, I was able to get back into the gym. My schedule is a little tight now that I'm back in school, but the gym is important, especially at our age, at, at my age. But I want you guys to give me some ideas about how you feel about my hair. I love my hair, but I'm getting negative feedback, which is weird. Sometimes, you know, you do things for yourself and you're pretty confident with um, how it would be perceived by your loved ones and the people you know. I wasn't so sure how my new hair and my new look would be perceived, but it's interesting. I wasn't too concerned because I love, 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 love locks, and I love natural hair, and now that I'm older, um, I think it's important for me to just, um, you know, garner all aspects of natural hair and um, natural hair lifestyle. Um, sooner than later because again I'm older and I love it I just love it. I think it's so yummy it's easy to wash it's easy breezy lemon squeezy I wake up and I shake and um, I just go I put some castor oil in my hair I put a couple of drops of peppermint and um, what was it peppermint and there was another oil that I put in my castor oil because I use um, heritage um, castor oil, which is delish. I love it. It makes my hair really thick at the root. But I put some peppermint and I put another oil in there. I'll let you guys know this weekend. And it keeps it from itching. It makes it grow. 
um, and it's easy to wash out. It doesn't create buildup. And um, I'm just like, wow, I really figured this out. But I, I want this journey to be something that we share. Hopefully I inspire other ladies to go ahead and take the plunge and um, either start locking their hair or go natural or cut it. Um, maintenance um, is so time consuming. So if you could pull off the balance of being attractive and feeling good about the way you look and no maintenance or very little maintenance, go for it. Especially if the finances are um, conducive to your lifestyle. Look at this slow traffic. You see how slow I'm moving? I'm moving like 10 miles an hour. Anyway, I'm going to put my jazz back on. I love my jazz. And I'm going to say goodbye for now so I can focus on the road. Let me know what you think.